Let me first congratulate Tamil Janam TV on their launch and I'm sure by adding one more channel it will give the voice to the people of Tamil Nadu. It's a platform for the people of Tamil Nadu and as I said in English, I'll say it in Hindi, Janam TV ka Janam hua hai, logon ki awaj ke liye, logon ki awaj pohunchane ke liye, logon tak pohunchane ke liye. I think if you look at India today, there are hundreds of channels who are providing good content, news to millions of Indians across states. Adding one more channel means it will give more opportunities to good reporters to report the work, also to create awareness among the programs and policies of the governments, and also to keep a check on the working of the government. It's very, very important for the media because the media plays a very, very important role, a decisive role in a democracy. And with the Tamil Janam TV coming, I'm sure they're going to play a very important role, especially when India Bharat has fixed a target of becoming a Viksit Bharat, a developed India by 2047. See, looking at the response Bharti Yanta Party getting across this country, you know the voice which comes from each nook and corner of the country today is my choice Modi, my choice Modi, my choice Modi. That is what people are saying. When you board an aircraft or you board a train or you're traveling, you're walking on the streets, people walk up to us, Apki bar, char so par. That is the voice in each nook and corner of the country. People want to see Prime Minister Modi for the third consecutive term so that India become the third largest economy of the world. People want to see more progress, growth of the country, the development of the country. People want to see more poor coming out of the marginal so as a, from the multidimensional poverty line, as they have come out, 25 crore people have come out of the multidimensional poverty line. They see when they come out of the multidimensional poverty line, they have a more spending power, creating more demand, creating more jobs, creating more self-employment and employment in the country. The Tamil Nadu Chief Minister's statement shows itself how nervous he is. From Prime Minister Modi is coming to Tamil Nadu. Why is he shivering? Why is he making such kind of statement? He should be happy that Prime Minister Modi is coming to Tamil Nadu because the people of Tamil Nadu loves Prime Minister Modi and say, my choice Modi. At the same time, Prime Minister Modi loves Tamil Nadu, the rich culture, tradition, history, and the progress of Tamil Nadu. When the new parliament building was opened, Sangol was installed, a great respect to the state of Tamil Nadu. By starting the program Kashi Tamil Sangamam, a great respect and a connect between Kashi and Tamil Nadu. Suraj Tamil Sangamam, not only this, but also the 44th Chess Olympia to the Khelo India Games given by the Prime Minister Modi to the state of Tamil Nadu. The visit of Xi Jinping to others. Prime Minister Modi has started the Fisheries Ministry and made the minister from the state of Tamil Nadu clearly coming out with thousands of crore rupees project and policies for the fishermen. On one hand, Prime Minister Modi is giving a lot to the fishermen with the subsidies and policies and programs. On the other hand, DMK and the Congress party has given the island of Kachathivu to whom Sri Lanka, they should come out open and respond to this. Who is responsible for giving Kacha Thibu Island to Sri Lanka? Why is DMK and Congress silent on this? Why they have given an important piece of land to Sri Lanka? Why they have heard the sentiments of Indians, Tamilians, also the fishermen? They must answer on this. They must come clean on this. Why are they silent?